my ex is someone that had hi beautiful people welcome to my channel if you are here of course you wanted to be here um today i just want to cut my hair <clears throat> i want to cut my hair and i'm gonna take you out with me on this journey of trying to cut my hair but firstly i need to make my bed um just come with me as i make my bed let's go I've only got two blankets. It's winter now, but I use two blankets to sleep. That's crazy, right? Imagine using two blankets to sleep. Huh? Hey, plus this thing. This is not like um it's not thick enough to 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 make you walk, but I'm a man. <laughs> I'm a man. If you come from the mountains, uh, everything is more like manly. And then everything being manly, it means that you don't need much of uh, blankets to sleep. You just need one blanket to sleep. Because in the mountain, you go with your blanket. That's the blanket that you use. I'm joking. It's like paradise. You. You have blankets, you get there, there's too many blankets, and then you get to wear that blanket. But you know what I wanna do? So this is how I make my bed. Let me show you. This is what it looks like after it's made. Here's my machine that I'm gonna use to cut my hair. Let's go. Oh no, let me. I shouldn't have made my bed. I shouldn't have made my bed. I shouldn't have made my bed. So what I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use this to cover the bed. When I'm whilst I'm still kind of like cutting my hair. So I'm just gonna be cutting my hair on top of this. On top of this this is how i want to place it and then i'm gonna be cutting my hair on top of it let's go maybe as i'm cutting my hair i need to do a story time you know i don't know what kind of a story but let me think so Okay, I saw this one video on TikTok. I wanna speak back on it. So this guy is like, people in relationships, um, sometimes in a relationship you live in a fantasy. A relationship can be a fantasy in a way that, um, in a way that when you, when you live with your partner, You realize that they are a different person from what you thought they would be. And then you get bored. You're like, I thought you were going to be someone different. Or you were going to be different from what I... I thought you are. Because there's a difference spending time with your person um maybe like two three days in a week you spend um the day with your person and there's a difference when you spend the uh like every day of your life with them because then you get to see everything about them you get to see their bad side you get to see their good side you get how you get to see their behavior or how they carry themselves when they are around you 24 7. because really like as as a person when you spend like when you spend like a few days with me 
um, like two days of, of a week. Obviously, I'm not gonna know everything about you, and obviously, I'm not gonna see everything about you. I'm just gonna know what I know. But if if I spend every day 24/7, which means I spend every minute of the day, every second of the day with you, and then I get to see you for you, and I get to see how you act, and then I get to decide whether I want to marry you or I just I just want to be in a relationship with you, or I don't want you anymore. I want to look at myself because there's something that. I, I wanna do with my hair. I wanna do with my hair. I wanna do with my hair. I don't have a mirror. <laughs> As you can see, I'm trying to look at myself through this fall. Shine back. So yeah, there's so many complications with relationships there's so many things sometimes you have to give up on certain things because you're like it's fine i won't find the perfect human being in life but sometimes it gets to a point where you're like nah i can't i can't deal I thought this person was going to be different, but now you realize with the difference that you wanted, you're not going to get it. And you have to be real with yourself. Sometimes you have to accept certain things that you can't change. Because really, you can't change them. Hey, I'm that day. That day, oh, here I go, I'm moving, here I get paid. <laughs> no, I just wanted to do that because um I wanna post a funny video somewhere some way on my status on TikTok or something. But let's continue cutting her. Let's continue cutting her. So there's one thing that I must ask you myself. If if you've been in a relationship with someone, or think that you've been in a relationship with someone, because some people they like, I don't consider you um I, I don't consider a relationship where whereby the relationship was just us um talking or us being in a relationship. We didn't kiss, we didn't have sex. So do you consider such a thing a relationship? What makes a relationship? Because like, I dated this girl for like five months. We only kissed. Was it five or six months? Five or six months. And we only kissed. That's the only thing that we did. We never had sex. Not because I didn't want to, because, I don't know, she, she didn't want me to maybe have vision breaker or something. She didn't want to let it all to me. She wanted someone different, like, but not me. So maybe that's what the, that's, that's the reason. She didn't allow me to be a vision breaker. So we dated for five months, but we, we never had sex. We only we, we would only kiss. We kiss. Um, we meet. We chill. We cuddle, and uh, that's all. I mean. So I'm asking myself: in that case. Do you consider what we were doing a relationship or it's just it's just us having fun? A situation is a relationship without sex and kiss a relationship. Because I remember also like in Begin Primary. Not 
I dated this other girl, but she. We've never kissed, and then we dated for like three weeks. We've never kissed, we'd only see each other at school because apparently she had strict parents who wouldn't let her leave or go around in the street. So she. We would meet at school only. We never met outside of school. Unless maybe it's after school and then I'm taking I'm out, I'm walking her home. That's the only time I'd say out, outside of school we have like a connection or something. But besides that, nothing. So do you consider that a relationship or what? Because there was no kissing, it was just it was just us having fun. Or us just talking. Is it still a, a relationship or what? Because some people they're like, ah, if we've never had sex, we've never if we've never kissed, I don't consider you my ex. My ex is someone I had sex with. But also, when it comes to sex, you're like, did someone who, who, who you had one night stand with, do you still consider that person uh, uh, your ex because you had one night stand with them? Do you say, this is my ex? Or how do you consider them? What are they then? Because if you base relationship on sex, then that person you had a one night stand with, they are supposed to be a boyfriend or something. I'm not sure when your relationship is based on sex. It's not based on spending quality time. I mean, if we spend quality time with each other, I'd consider that relationship, regardless of us having sex or not. But if we spend immaculate time together, that's a relationship. That's a relationship. Oh, the dating someone you you can't kiss because I remember when I dated this person that I didn't kiss it's not like I didn't want to kiss her but it was her who who Naba she didn't want to be kissed asked for a kiss she was like nah no way, my nigga, you're gonna kiss me. I was like, what? Why? She's like, nah, it's not gonna happen. I was like, okay, it's fine then. If you're not gonna kiss, it's fine. If I to Sunana, I says, it's okay, it's okay, it's fine. And then it got to a point where like our relationship was done. I don't know what's the thing when, when someone when someone is done with you, they just keep quiet. And uh, they give you excuses. Like you're like, can I see you? They're like, no, you can't see me, I'm busy. I'm doing this, da 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 da. And then they're like, okay, fine. You, you get that response most of the time until you are tired of the response. And then you're like, okay, it's fine. I read the signs. I, I, I get it now. It's like, you don't want to be with me. So, okay, I'm just going to bounce. I guess it's done because... Because what you're giving me is... We are done vibes. 
those vibes are the vibes that I get. And then I'm like, okay, I bounce. I'm out of here. Salah, no relationship, yeah, or Salah. Salah. I don't, I don't mind. I don't care anymore. But so it's like it's okay. If you don't want to, you don't want to. Just gonna leave you alone. I'm done. I'm done. How do I look? I look good, right? I look good. And that's it. I'm done. So, peace. Thank you for being with me while I cut my hair. But now, peace.